Now, four years ago, it was derelict and locals feared they'd lost their village pub forever. But now the Wanston Arms near Sutton Scotney has been named the National Pub of the Year by the Campaign for Real Ale. Joe Kent has spent most of the day there. Just four years ago, the Wanston Arms looked like this, unloved and destined for closure. Then in stepped one of the regulars, Matt Todd, who changed his career and with it the pub's future. Today he received the Campaign for Real Ale's Pub of the Year award to the delight of his loyal locals. It's a day I never dreamed would happen. Just getting in the good beer guide was really, really important. Four and a half thousand pubs out of 40,000, that's one in ten, isn't it? That's a, good, that's a good result, and that's what we imagined. If we could get there, that would be a really, really good place for the Once and Arms to, to be in the UK. We find ourselves here today, top of the shop. I think it's a complete package here. It's not just a good beer, it's not just a great service, it's not just a great landlord. It's a pub which delivers in spades on all of those criteria. And, and it has this great backstory. This was a derelict pub four or five years ago. It's rescued. It proves beyond doubt there's no such thing as an unviable pub. Behind the bar, there's an ever-changing selection of beers, many of them locally brewed. But the pub has an interesting past. The previous landlord was the driver for notorious East End gangsters, the Cray Twins. Rumour has it the pub was a retirement gift to him and the brothers were regular visitors when the pub would shut to the public. Now it welcomes everyone. It's lovely, it's just so friendly and comfortable and yeah, it's just a nice pub to come to. We sat here today meeting people we've never met before. Uh, it's a community, it's lovely. It's it's fun. It's what pubs should be, really. It's very, very local and it does excellent beers. So that's the reason. And we can walk here. <laughs> You know, I've got a bit of pub envy. I wish this was my local. Well, things are winding down here after this memorable day at the Wanston Arms. It's the first pub in Hampshire ever to win Pub of the Year. And it's a great story about the vision and determination of landlord Matt here to turn around a failing business and put this pub right back at the heart of the community. Back to you, Tom. Thank you, Joe. Or should I say cheers?